We have another lost city that has been discovered, and there are many of them out there. Of course, all the myths, all the legends in regards to all these ancient cities, some which sit below water, others underneath the sands, others hidden in plain sight, as this one seems to have been with everything over time eroded away or kind of leveled this area or this mound where these 92 clay tablets were unearthed is proving to be an ancient city that was talked about it was referenced many times in ancient writings but people just had no clue they're saying that this is an important northern mesopotamian city or should I say, an ancient royal city of Mardaman. Now, it had these tablets that were inside this pottery that was then wrapped in clay. The condition was said to be kind of in a frail state where they were kind of semi-crumbling, but nonetheless, they were able to decipher them. They're saying that this was all in cuneiform. They're also stating that it existed between 2,200 and 1,200 years B.C. And that this region was conquered and destroyed many times over. Here is a view of that area. Now, I would like to see others decipher this. I'd like to see others that are experienced in cuneiform do a deciphering of these instead of one man and letting no one else see it. And then, once we can get some confirmations there, we can continue to move on to other regions around it that may be connected. I think it's interesting when you find these lost cities, because in biblical terms and in other texts, they reference these cities that people have no clue where they are or what. Now, now finding one city could actually unlock a lot of clues that people may not see at first. Something may have been referenced in a passage, an older passage, stating that there's something at that location. No one ever knew where the location was. Now, if they know where the location is and you know that passage and what they're talking about, then you know that in this region, there's something hidden. This goes right along the lines of what I believe they've been after this whole time. Going into Iraq, Libya, what they want in Syria... These ancient ruins, ancient technology, high technology, among other things. But more information here at this link that I'll leave below pertaining to this site. And as always, I'll continue to update if I come across anything else similar to this. It's been Dabu7. Peace.